Chosen was where you were, where you were, where you were. Chosen was back with another powerful and productive video. Yes, chosen people. Yes, as you said that you like the smiling exercise. Let's stay with it, right? So let's quickly do our smiling exercise and then we proceed with the video. Make it a point to plant some beautiful smile on your face, chosen people. Yes, you are such a beautiful soul. Thank you so much. Thank you for doing so. You read the title of this video, chosen people. In some other video of mine, I talked about your eyes aren't, aren't normal. Your eyes aren't normal. It scares folks. Yes. But chosen people. You see, scripture says in that book of Matthew 7, verse 7, that ask and it shall be given, knock and it shall be opened, search and you will find. Right, great. Which means God wants us to ask, right? Um, you see, when Jesus had an encounter with a blind man, or the blind man had a, an encounter with Jesus, something happened. Jesus knew the man wants to see. But Jesus asked him again, what do you want me to do for you? Right? And the blind man said, Lord, I want to see. And Jesus said to him, yes, your faith has made you whole. Yes, you see, sometimes there is greatness inside of us. There is something valuable inside of us. We've been blessed with, with something, but we got to activate it. Yes, you got to activate it so that it will be working properly, right? That's it. So your eyes, okay, you can activate. Yes, you can activate your eyes of faith by speaking to it. Right, and when you speak to it, I tell you, it's going to scare the, the 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 hell out of people. I'm telling you, chosen people, that's it. Right, great. So, to activate your eyes, to scare the hell out of people, you have to speak to it. Right, and. It's simple. This is it. Father God, I thank you. I thank you for my eyes. Thank you. For I know that my eyes are the window, the windows to my soul. And so is the eyes of every other person. It never lies. But it brings out what is inside of the person through that gate. Oh Lord God Almighty, speak through my eyes. Speak through my eyes. Speak through my eyes in all circumstances, in all things. When I confront people or people confront me, Speak through my eyes. When people are lying, help me, Spirit of God, to know they are lying. Speak through my eyes that by looking in my eyes, they cannot dare lie to me, but to speak that which is true to me. Spirit of God, manifest yourself so mightily so strong in my eyes. Yes, Spirit of God, open my eyes of faith to see the good in people. Open my eyes of faith to see those that I need to stay away from as well. Open my eyes 
of faith that I may be able to connect with the things you want me to connect with and to disconnect from the things you want me to disconnect with. Open my eyes of faith, O Spirit of God, that I may know you more and more and more and more. Open my eyes of faith, O Spirit of God, to be conscious, to be mindful of my faith in you, in pressure and intention time. Help me see just like you would see. Help me watch and pray and help me watch just like you will watch. Speak through my eyes that only that which is of positive vibe, positive energy, good energy, good spirit will be absorbed into my eyes since my eyes are the windows to my soul. Speak through my eyes that it will despair every evil energy that will try to penetrate into my eyes. Speak through my eyes that anything evil, anything bad will not penetrate in my eyes. Spirit of God, help me. I speak this into existence and I know so will it be. Thank you, Father. Thank you for opening my eyes of faith. Thank you for speaking through my eyes. Thank you for manifesting yourself through my eyes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Chosen people, when you say this and you mean it, so will it be. And I tell you, not everybody will be able to. I mean, look in your eyes and lie to you. You will see people for who they are. Yes, people cannot stand face to face with you and look in your eyes and lie to you. I'm telling you, so will it be. You see, this same mouth, if it can be used to lay cares on someone, right? This same mouth can be used to speak blessings and how you want things to be into existence and it will happen. Yes. So, speak things into existence. Right? That's it. What you confess, your confessions, determines the life you enjoy. That is why prayer works. Because when you are praying, you are speaking things you want to see in your life. You're speaking it into existence. Yes. And so, shall it be. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video. I'm out for now. Peace.